Hello, third grade. How are you today? Well, today is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday? Tuesday. Tuesday, the 4th of August. Bye-bye, July. Hello, August. August. And what's the weather like? Is it a sunny day, cloudy day, windy day? It's a sunny, sunny day. day. Sunny and cold or sunny and hot? Sunny and hot. Sunny and hot. And windy too, yes? Y es tampoco windy, mentoso, yes? Okay, so today we are going to check pages 110, 112, and 113 from the activity book. And you have to keep handing your postcard. Me tienen que entregar la postcard. Espero ver cosas re lindas. Y chequear correcciones de holiday homework. Entonces, una de las tareas, la tarea de hoy va a ser solamente, no hay nada de writing, va a ser escribir, eh, va a ser activity book pages, but, pero va a haber y estudiar los verbos, acordate que los verbos son repeticiones de la lista, Ta. ¿ok? De tu lista, pero aparte de eso, va a haber un trabajito, ¿cuál es el trabajito que vas a tener? Vas a hacer, es, te vas a tomar el trabajo de abrir, Todas tus correcciones de la composición 18 y número 1, ¿sí? Que me escribiste durante las vacaciones. Ojo que hubo gente que no entregó las tareas de las vacaciones. Así que se pone al día, ¿sí? ¿Yes? Porque nosotros estamos ya entregando estas tareas de las colegas, ya las entregamos a todas, ¿sí? ¿Yes? Ok, ahora ya tenemos demanda de lo que entra, de lo nuevo. Por ejemplo, postcard. Vas a abrir todos tus files y vas a chequear tus corrects, tus correcciones, tus corrections, ¿está? Porque si vos me mandás, acá está tu lista de verbos, quiero que hagas repeticiones de la lista. Puse toda la lista, ¿sí? ¿Está? Entonces, haces de la 1, de la 2, de la 3, tenete en tu cuadernito, anda haciendo repetition, ¿está? Dos veces, tres veces, ¿sí? ¿Ok? Y si quieres... Porque esto tiene que estar. Después en clase lo vamos a leer también. ¿Yes? Ok. Pero la parte que tenés que repetir la tenés que hacer vos. Esa sería la parte que tenés que hacer en casa. Bueno. So pay attention. Uh, common mistakes. Tengo errores comunes. Ok. Si yo, if I have love, like, don't like, don't like, hate, ¿Cómo va el verbo después de todo esto? Más ING, well done, Aldana, plus ING. Entonces, cada uno identifica sus errores. Por ejemplo, Alejo, Pilar también, love, like, don't like, doesn't like, okay, más ING. ¿Qué vas a hacer? Entonces, en tu cuadernito, ahora, saca tu cuaderno de inglés, en tu cuaderno vas a anotar los common mistakes, que son los errores comunes, ¿sí? Put the date. ¿Yes? Y ponemos rapidito esta lista a modo de ejemplo. Este sería el hashtag 1. Hashtag 2. Uh, no olvidar. E o an, ojo, valen, Valentina, más los jobs, más las profesiones. Pongo professions acá. ¿Yes? E doctor, e teacher, e lawyer, e dentist. ¿Yes? ¿Ok? Plurals, los plurales. No olvidar la S de los plurales. Nahuel, ¿sí? Que llevan E, S, S. ¿Yes? Bien prolijito esta listita. Bueno, y on más, sería hashtag 3, hashtag 4, on más los di, di, as, they, at más la O. Ya. ya. ¿Ok? ¿Es clear? Yes. Y Alejo, esto va especialmente para vos. Venías hablando, bueno, decía, este no noten. They told eh, students, le, le dijo a los estudiantes, las teachers, that uh, they would go, they would go, iban a ir de expedición o algo así, ¿no? They would take They would take us, pa, 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 a una expedición, o a, a un viaje de estudios, ¿yes? Entonces, they told, como vos venís hablando acá en pasado, le pusiste acá will, y no va will, 
sino que va a would. Porque cuando yo estoy hablando del pasado, un futuro, en el pasado, ella nos dijo que iríamos, querías decir vos, entonces sería would, más el verbo en infinitivo, ¿está? Como para que entiendas tu corrección, ¿sí? ¿Yes? ¿Ok? Esto es, um, lo vamos a dar, pero mucho más adelante, ¿está? Well, so we have love, like, don't like, doesn't like, hate, plus ing. EOR más professions, plurals, e, e, S, S, OR más dates, AT más hora. ¿Sí? ¿Yes? Entonces, todas estas, um, these mistakes are the common mistakes. Después cada uno va a abrir su file y va, you are going to open your file and you are going to see, ah, sí, entendí muy bien acá, ay, me pude haber comido la coma, los puntos, ojo, vale, comas, puntos, Ojo, eh, Alejo también, ¿sí? Punto seguido, coma, cuando está el and, no pongo coma. Entonces, todos esos puntuación es el error que más te mata, porque es un punto, ¿vale? Pero un punto, me descuenta la tiche, porque si está mal puesto la coma, si está mal puesto los, pu mal puesto los puntos, ¿qué pasa? Cambia totalmente el significado de lo que yo quiero decir. ¿Ok? Bueno, esto copiado, entonces, voy a poner post en tu video. Yes, ¿ok? And we are going to check pages, ¿ok? Vamos a chequear las pages. Muy bien, eso fue holiday homework. Yes, well done. Good, so let's go to the pages. Can I clean the board? Yes, of course. Yes. Si no miran la corrección que hace la teacher, es como que el trabajo, vos trabajaste mal y yo. Muy buenas composiciones. Muy buena la introducción, muy bien eh, la introducción de eh, tu persona, después el primer día en la escuela, the first day at school. Excelente. Miren porque hay muy buenos resultados, ¿eh? Hay muy buenos resultados. Hay gente que tiene 100% bien en las composiciones, 90%. Well done. Ok, let's go. Uh, page 110, 110. Dale, ok. So, swimming activity, activities in the lake. Yes, ok. Hiking, put a tick. Fishing. Si no la tengo, lo agrego. Hiking, fishing. Mountain biking, sauna. Yes, sauna. Yes. Hiking, fishing, mountain biking, sauna. Stay. Quedarse. Acuérdate que stay es quedarse, no estar, ¿eh? I am at home. Estoy en casa. I stay at home. Me quedo en casa. Yes, ok. I will stay, in a beauty, stay at a beautiful hotel. Stay in a beautiful hotel near the beach. Me quedaré. Yes, ok. Entonces no confundan el verbo to be con el quedarse, permanecer. Stay. Summer holiday, summer cottage. Yes. ¿Qué era cottage? Una ca... Cabaña. Cabaña. Day trips. Los trips que va a hacer. Theme park y festival. Yes, ok. Listo. Let's go to number two. One. Are you ready? Yes, ok. Two, perdón, porque el one ya está hecho. He goes to the cottage by the lake in the summer. He goes to the cottage by the lake in the summer. Three, the sun never go da goes down in June and... July. Yeah. Muy bien. Four, he usually, he usually goes swimming. ¿Qué más? Hiking and... Fishing, yes, okay. Five, he's going to go mountain biking. Six, he's going to go to a theme park and a fest. Chiba. Okay, 112, 112, yes, 112, 112, 112, 112, yes, 112. Dale, good. An animal, a dog. Yes? You can put water and lemonade in the container? A bottle. A bottle. Yes? A country, ¿dónde pasó esta historia? De la, the message in the bottle. Turkey. Turkey también es Turquía y pavo. Yes? Number four, a place with a lot of sun? The beach. 
The beach. ¿Qué quiere decir sand? Arena. Arena. Y sandy. Castle. The sand castle. Y sandy, ¿qué quiere decir? Arenoso. Muy bien, Aldana. Well done. Number five. A number bigger than ten, but smaller than fifteen. Y le. Ven. Ven. Ok. Number two. Two. Every day. Three. Beach. Four. El e. El e. A letter, yes. An email, a letter, yes. El, el, el mensaje estaba escrito donde? En un email o en un message? En una letter. Mm. Nergis wrote an email. ¿Eso es cierto o no? Yeah. What did he write? A message. A message what? But in a letter, in an email, in an Instagram, in Facebook? Um. In a letter, yes, in a letter. ¿Lo pusiste así? No, con el letter. Yes, porque dice dónde estaba el mensaje, el message. Number five, verat. Yes, okay. Good. ¿Cuál es el mensaje secreto, Alana? My name is Paul. I am in the airfield. My name is? Paul. Paul. I am? In year three. In year three. Good. Well, so let's go to page 113, 113. Lo de arriba solamente era. 2D. 2D. 3. 3. Alana, 3. 3. 4. 4. A, B, C. C, U. C. Sí, see you soon, ok? Good, good, good. So pay attention now. Let's go to the board. Ahora sí que tenemos cositas muy interesantes. Yes? So, the first thing we are going to do. Ok. Aldana, can you come here, please? We are going to find the differences. Find the differences. Yes? We have picture A and picture B. ¿Cómo formamos el, el future? Subject, Subject. plus am, um, are, o, plus going, going to, plus verb in infinity. Yes, infinity. Muy bien. Ok. So. Para precalentar, what are you going to do next summer? I'm going to, vamos a imaginar, no vamos a decir vamos a quedarnos en casa, eh. I'm going to go to the beach. I'm going to go swimming. I'm going to walk near the beach. What are you going to do? I'm going to visit a water park. Water park, what else? I'm going to go to the beach. Mm -hmm. I'm going to travel by uh, by plane, by bus. By bus. Okay, what are you going to do? Three activities you are going to do. I'm going to watch TV. I'm going to do my homework. On holidays? Yes. No, impossible. Woo! Okay, I'm going to listen to music. I'm going to... Uh, watch uh, TV, I'm going to see, uh, I'm not going to see horror films, I'm not going to see horror films, I'm not going to correct, I'm not going to do my uh, plans, I'm not, I'm not going to do my homework, uh -huh. I'm not going to play football. Okay, are you going to play rugby? Yes, I am or no, I am not? No, I am not. Okay, question for the teacher. Are you going to... Study? No, I am not. Are you going to read a book? Yes, I am. What book are you going to read? A horror book? A, um, a mysterious book. A mysterious book? A mystery book? A mystery book, okay, like Harry Potter. Harry Potter, oh, Harry Potter is very long, yes, long and thick, yes, okay, well, are you ready, yes, 
So, are you, te lo respondo, tres, me tenés que decir, yes I am, no I am not. Are you going to go swimming? Are you going to listen to music? Are you going to next holiday? Are you going to play football? Are you going to do your homework? Are you, what is it, no I am, you say, yes I am, no I am not, depending on, yes. Are you going to play football? Yes I am. Are you going to read a book? Yes, I am. Are you going to do your homework? No, I am not. Are you going to study math? No, I am not. What are you going to do? I'm going to go to the beach. I'm going to visit a water park. Mm. I'm going to... Relax in the yeah. beach. Okay. Well, permiso, excuse me. Yes, okay. Well, so here we have picture A. And picture B. Vos lo vas a hacer en casa. Todo lo que hacemos nosotros, que yo estoy usando a Lana de model, vos lo haces en casa. Respondes y respondes. Yes, I am, no, I am not. Or what question? Where? Where are you going to go? I'm going to go to Cancun. Where are you going to go? I'm going to go to Miami. Miami. And what are you going to do in Miami? I'm going to relax. Relax. I'm going to read a funny book. A funny book. Okay, is it clear? What about you? What are you, where are you going to go? And what are you going to do? Yes? Okay, este video está muy bueno porque es para practicar future. Come on. Go there. Yes. And be careful, darling. I'm going to move the, the picture. Yes. Okay. There we are. Uh, be careful with your, yes, there we are, okay, yes, because you can't cover, yes, you can't cover the picture, so your place could be there, okay, well, we are going to use this, but not with these parts, not the mata mosca, but with these parts, okay, is it clear? So, this is spot the difference, this is a game, spot the difference, yes, okay, so, in picture A, grandfather is going to read the newspaper. In picture B, in picture B, the father is going to read a newspaper. The newspaper, okay. In picture A, the cat is going to sleep. And in picture B, in picture B. Ah, on the floor. The cat is going to sleep on the floor in front of the television. And in picture B? In picture B, the cat is sleeping. Is going to, future. Is going to, is sleeping. Nah, qua, 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 te desconcentraste. Is going to sleep. Is going to sleep mm -hmm. in a sofa. In the sofa or on the sofa? On the sofa. On the sofa. Between? Between. The grandma and the mom. Okay. In picture A, in picture A, grandmother, the mother, is going to watch TV. And in picture B, ring, ring, what is she going to do? She's going? She's going to read, talk with her friends. Okay, talk with her friend. She's going to talk on the floor, on the phone, yes? Go back a little, yes, okay. Well, in picture, um, in picture A, a ver, voy a acercarme un poquito más, yes? Así lo pueden ver y puedes usar esta picture en tu casa, yes? Okay, you can use the same picture, okay? Excuse me. In picture A, in picture A, this, the brother is listening to music. And in picture B, blah, 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 blah. In picture B, the brother is going to talk with her sister. Yes, he's going to talk to the sister. And in picture A, he's going to listen to music. Yes, pay attention. In picture, you start. Future is going. In picture B. What's the louder? In picture B, the 
dog is going to eat the food. the food. And in picture A, I think the family is going to eat the food. And the dog is sleeping. And the, the dog is? Ah, yes, I didn't find the dog. The dog is going to go sleep. To go yeah. to sleep. Yes, the dog is going to sleep. Okay? Well, uh, thank you, Aldana. Thank you. I will call you. Yes, give me the matamonka, please. Yes. Good. So pay attention. You can use this picture. Mira, te la dejo libre. Yes. You can do, use this picture in picture. Ah, in picture A, the sister is going to write a poem. And in picture um, B, the sister is going to think about the poem. Viste que no está escribiendo ahí. Yes, is it clear? Yes. Good. Ah, in picture B, what is he going to do? He's going to drink coffee. To drink coffee and well and that's all yes it's a very nice picture yes okay so this is the things they are going to do so with the same picture we are going to practice when ¿Qué quiere decir when? Cuando. okay when when I arrive when I arrive home, cuando llegue a donde? A mi casa. A casa, yes. I'm going, con estas actividades, Aldana, dale, I'm going to? I'm going to? Mm -hmm. Talk to my friends. Ah, talk to your friends. Talk to? Talk, talk to, to uh, my friends. Mm -hmm. When I arrive home, I'm going to do gymnastic. I'm going to do gymnastic. When I arrive home, I'm going to watch TV. When I arrive home, I'm going to watch TV. When I arrive home, arrive home, I'm going to read the newspaper. The newspaper. When I arrive home, uh, when I arrive home, I'm going to drink coffee. Tenés otra más, Lana? Another more? I'm going to. When I arrive. When I arrive home, I'm going to play with my sister. Sister. Play with my sister. When I arrive home, I'm going to. Um, read a book. Is it clear? So, using this picture in tu cuaderno de inglés, yes, open your folder, please. Open your folder. No cierres el libro, yes, okay? You are going to write two or three sentences, sentences using this picture with when I arrive home. Cuando llegue a casa voy a... Y acá tenemos ejemplos. When I arrive home, yes, okay? When I arrive home, bien prolijito. Yes, two sentences. Y se redondeo o le hago un cuadrado a ese when. ¿Viste que te puse más cerca? When I arrive home, I'm going to talk to my friends. On the phone, si quieren poner. When I arrive home, I'm going to do gymnastic. When I arrive home, I'm going to watch TV. When I arrive home, I'm going to read a book. When I arrive home, I'm going to play uh, with the computer, yes? To my phone? On the phone, yes, I'm going to talk, yes, to my friends, on the phone, see, on the phone, yes, todas las cosas que voy a hacer cuando llegue a casa, usando when, yes, is it clear? Vos lo podés pausar y hacer la frase, yes, bien prolijito, bien prolijito, yes, okay, good, is it clear? Good. Well done. So let's go back. Ahora sí, Aldana, otra vez. Te voy a necesitar en breve. Wait. Yes. Okay. Good. Quedaron las frases claras de when I arrive home. Qué bueno que puedes tener esto y mirarlo varias veces. ¿eh? Yes, yes, yes. Good, good, good. Ok, 
Okay, so pay attention here. Stand up, please, Alana. Go to the board. Hello. Hello. Okay. Well. Uh, 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 um. The thing is like this. We are going to revise what you do every summer, what you do last summer, yes, and what you are going to do. Yes, okay, is it clear? So, last summer, every summer, yes. Okay, last summer, ¿qué quiere decir last summer? El pasado. Entonces, si digo last summer, voy a usar un verbo con ed o un verbo, yes, irregular. Yes, muy bien. Si yo voy a decir next summer, voy a armar el future. I'm going to, I'm going, lo que venimos repasando, to, más infinitivo. Yes or no? Yes. Y si digo every day, voy a decir I, usually, I play, I usually go to the beach, I usually watch TV. Yes or no? Yes. Dale. Are you ready? Yes. Good. So, choose one. Last summer, every summer, or next summer? Mm, every summer. Every summer? Every summer, I'm going no, to... No, 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 no. You have to... I will choose. You choose every summer. Yes? I'm going to go... Listen. Every summer is present simple. Last summer is past. And next summer is going to future. Yes. Which one do you choose? Every summer. Every summer. I choose next summer. And now you have to find, tiene que encontrar, ¿qué cosa? Una actividad que está en present simple. Yes? Is it clear? Yes. Y vas a ganar un punto. Yes? Okay, I will have teacher Ruth aquí. And... Aldana here. Yes, para los puntos. Yes or no? Yes. Okay. Next summer, dale. It's a competition. I will say, ready, steady, go. Uh, next summer, what is this every summer? Every Todavía summer. no? Oh, yes. Okay, no yet. Next summer, you. Every summer. I'm going to, ya encontraste, ready, steady, go. Pap, te gané. Uh, I'm going to go hiking. Punto para mí. A ver, Aldana, ¿cuál elegiste? Every summer I visit the museum. Bueno, la, la respuesta está bien, pero no lo hizo antes. Así que, cuan, 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 cuan. Ok, la teacher tiene un punto. Dale, come on. Is it clear? Lo importante es que te concentre en lo que estamos practicando. Ok. Uh, ¿Cuál elegiste? Which one? Um, last summer. Last summer. No. Okay. Last summer. Primero pienso, is past, future o present? Um, future. Last summer. Um, past, future o present? Past. Past. Pay attention. No, todavía no dije, ready, said it go. I choose every summer. Ok. Ready, steady, go. Last summer. Oh, well, Alana. Camping, well done, one point for Aldana. Yes. Y yo dije next summer, ¿no? Yes. No, every summer, every summer elegí yo. Every summer, iba a poner esta, I visit a theme park, ¿ok? Dale. Uh, which one do you choose? Vamos a elegir la misma, las dos, dale. Every summer. Every summer. Present. Every summer is present. Ready, steady, go. Next summer. No, las dos elegimos okay. every summer. I play video game, for, point for the teacher. Dale. Ready, come on, continue, 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 come on. Every summer. No, next summer, las dos, dale, next summer. That is future, future. Next summer, ready. Pues ya tenés que ir mirando, you have to look. Ready, steady, go. Go. Okay. I'm going to go fishing. Okay, one point for Aldana. Yes. Okay. Last summer, last summer is present. Past or future, last summer? Future. 
Last summer. Fast. Fast. Okay. Ready. Steady. Go. go. Teacher Ruth went camping. Oh, One boy for me. Visited my friends. Visited my friends. I'm Italian. Dale. Uh, every summer. Present. Past or future? Every summer. Present. Present. Ready. Steady. Go. Oh. oh. Yes. Okay. One point for Aldana. The last one, the last one, okay? Uh, next summer is present. Pa, vos contestan casa. Present, past or future? Future. Future. Next summer. <laughs> no dijimos ready, te digo. Okay. Next summer. Ready, steady, go. Go. Okay, well, Aldana. I am going to mountain biking. I'm going to go mountain biking. Okay. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Qua, 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 qua. Did you okay. Okay. Thank you. I won. Bye. Yes, okay, good. Thank you, Aldana. Now we can go to the pages. Yes, esto te tiene que quedar. Mira, te lo acerco bien para que vos te practiques en casa. Y yo sé que hay algunas eh, mamás que también están aprendiendo, así que pueden hacer este juego. Yes, y le explicamos a mamá o algo. Yes, o a papá. Yes, que están repasando también algunos con las clases. Yes, okay, good. Well. Well done. I like this game. Cuando vengan lo vamos a jugar juntos. Yo tengo todo guardado, ¿eh? Shall we go to the pic to the book, please? Wow, se me están rompiendo los matamoscas. Mucha energía. A lot of energy. Okay. Well, shall we go very quickly? Ahora vamos a ir a pages. 121, 123, 124, 125 from the classbook, ¿ok? With the dates. Bien, ahora ya saben que como ya teníamos el tema explicado. Ah, atención, la clase que viene tenemos, ¿qué cosa? Revision. Revision de la unit 9, ¿yes? ¿Qué tenemos que estudiar? Future. Future. Yes. A uh, present simple, past simple, porque va a ser un repasito de todo. Yes, vocabulario, beach activities y holidays activities. Y postcard, cómo hacer una postcard. Pero lo que más voy a enfatizar va a ser el fu, tu, do. Yes, ok. Good. Well, um, are you ready? Good, good, good. 122. Ok, ¿qué dice la primera actividad? Can you guess what these are? What these are? Write the words. Ok, escriba la palabra. Number one, what's this? Bus. Bus. Una, la, no la actividad, sino el, el sustantivo, el noun. Yes, ok. ¿Es clear? Yes. Good. Bus. Number two. Come. No. Towel, towel, T-O-W-E-L, yes, toalla, yes, yes, okay, number three, water park, water park, number four, bucket, bucket, yes, un balde, yes, okay, vocabulario de la clase pasada, number, um, a ver, a ver si lo adivinas, Number five. Swimsuit. Ah. Oh, swimsuit. Muy bien, Arlana. No swim, sino suit. Swimsuit. Repetition. Swimsuit. Swimsuit. Okay. Number six. Sun. Glasses. Sunglasses. Number seven. Um, tent. 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 Yes, tent. La carpa, chicos. Tent, que es de la campaña también se le dice. Ok, y después tenemos swimming, swimming trunks. Yes, que son los shortcitos que usan los chicos. Yes, las bermuditas. Swimming trunks. Yes o no? Yes. Mira, ahí escribió la teacher para que no sabía. Yes, ok. Well. So we are going to complete the dialogue. Tenemos climb. Nine. Do, Do. dos veces se puede usar. See, See. Have. have, take, take. y go three times. Dale. Hey, Sofía, ¿qué le va a preguntar? ¿Qué vas a hacer? What a ver. Are you going to do this summer? Good, Aldana. What are you going to do I'm this going summer? I'm going to New York. 
I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Completémosle. I'm going to go. Porque puedes usar el presente continuo con idea de futuro. Pero eso lo vamos a ver más adelante. Agregale nomás vos el I'm going to go, por más de que no esté ahí. Yes. Se puede decir I'm going to New York. Yes. Porque se puede usar el presente continuo con idea de futuro. Pero eso más adelante. What are you going to do this summer? I'm going to go to New York. Wow, that's great. Vas a escalar. Are you? Are you? Are you? Going to climb. Are you going to climb the Statue of Liberty? Porque se sube mucho este escalón. Are you going to climb? ¿Y qué le dice la nena? Yes, I am. Yes, I am taking a bus tour. Yes, ok. Bueno, I am going to take. Vamos a ponerle nosotros porque estamos practicando el future. I'm going to take a bus tour. I'm going to take a bus tour. That sounds great. Fenomenal. What about, how about you? What are you going to do this summer? ¿Y qué va a ser él? We going to. We going or we are going to go. We are going. We are going to go to. We are going to go to. Porque vos pones we are going to que es vamos a go to le tenés que agregar ir está así que ojo porque a veces queremos poner we are going to Miami. We are going to go to Miami. Yes, is it clear? No te olvides del verbo en infinitivo. Yes, okay. Next, we are going to go hiking and we are going to see blah, blah, blah. Yes, what are you going, what are you going to do there? Y el chico le responde, we are going to go hiking. We are going to go hiking and we are going to see the gate. What, uh, it sounds fun. We are going to have a great time. We are going to have a great time. Yes? Vamos rapidito a la página 123. Vamos a salir a 123. Y completamos el text. Complete the text with. Marcamos por favor las palabras. Hiking. Hiking. Snorkeling. Snorkeling. Beach. Beach. Rock pool. Rock pool. Mountains. Mountains. Okay. Alana, start please. My name? My name is Camila. Fuerte. In summer, Louder. I usually go to the beach. A lot. I go... I go... To, I usually go to the beach. Yes. I go in the sea. ¿Qué actividad de ahí puede ser? In the sea. I go to... No. I go fishing. I go hiking. I go snorkeling. No está swimming arriba. De las palabritas de arriba son al lado. I go snorkeling. I go snorkeling in the sea. I go snorkeling in the sea. I go fishing in the... Rock pools. Rock pools. This summer, I'm going to go to the... Mountains. Mountains with my family for a week. We are going to go... Hiking. Hiking, yes, ok. Good. Entonces, hiking, hiking, con los palos. Go hiking. Yes, pa, escalar, no de climbing. No, 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 no. Es senderismo. ¿Sí? Está, viste que vas con los palos. Go hiking. Ahí está, mira. El primero. ¿Ves que tienen esos, eh, no quiero decir mal, pero como unos una especie de stick? Entonces, eso es para ir caminando, pero. Hiking, yes, subiendo porque va para arriba. You go up y ves diferentes paisajes. You see the mountains. Yes, now take the best title for the text. ¿Cuál sería el, el mejor título? Camila's Day, Camila's Life o Camila's Holidays? Camila's Holidays. Camila's Holidays, well done. Page 124. Y ahí tenés un juego que es Spot the Difference. Tenés como el que jugamos. Por ejemplo, en Picture A, en Picture A, The boy is the boy is what? Um, Sir? Thin. And in picture B, the boy is snorkeling. Ah, uh -huh. in picture A, uh, the boy is wearing a red hat. No, in picture A, 
the boy isn't wearing a hat, but in picture uh, B, the boy is wearing a red hat. hat. Uh, in picture um, B, the girl is using a bucket. A bucket. A bucket color red. Uh -huh. And in picture B, the girl is using a bucket color. No, color, color red. No, a red. Yes, primero se dice el color. Red. ¿Cómo sería? A red. Mm-hmm, yes. And el chico también. In picture A, the boy is on a blank. Yes. A black salida yes. tuya? A red. A red blanket. Como una manta. red blanket. And in picture B, the boy is sitting on the sand. Yes. Okay. Good. Eso también sirve para practicar. Vamos. Page 124. Yes. Okay. Good. How many everyday activities can you say? Alana, every day I get dressed, read please. Every day I get dressed, every day I get undressed. Undressed? Undressed, mm -hmm. every day I put on. Put on your? Back. Mm -hmm. Put on your jacket, put on your shoes. Every day I? Every day I put on my shoes, every day I Take off my shoes uh -huh. for, for saying the saying the bed mm -hmm. the bank the bank bag yes okay every day I invite friends yes every day I lose my I lose my crops <laughs> my crops crops le decimos para no decir la marca Yes, okay. Como la televisión. Okay, look. Well, so, I want you to match exercise 3, the words here with the words from A to F. The numbers from 1 to 6 with the words from A to F. Dale, unimos por favor. Yes, okay. Recording yeah. 4. Listen and repeat. When I put Language Booster 3. Recording 3. Think about the story in act. Language Booster 3. Recording 1. Listen and read. Okay, ready? I put on my coat when it's cold. Y van a marcar todos los verbos de arriba with the highlighter. Aldana, did you do that? Yes, get dressed. Get undressed with the highlighter. Put on, take off, invite and lose. Yes. Y después, ¿vieron? Esto es lo que vimos hoy. Unir las frases con el uso de when. ¿Está? Yes or no? Yes. I put on my coat when it's cold. I take off my shoes. When I get home, yes, no, uno con flecha, eh, uno con, esto te enseñamos desde junior A, yes, uno con la letra, dos B, I take off my shoes when I get home, home. my friend invited me to his, party. to his party, yes, I get dressed every, every morning, my mom sometimes loses, her phone. her phone, yes. My brother and my mother and my sister and my other brother always um, lose the keys. Yes, okay. What? The keys, las llaves, they lose the keys. And my sister finds the keys. And your sister finds the keys, yes. I get undressed. I get undressed before I go to the bed. bed okay? The bed. Now repeat. Say the words. Repetition. One. I get dressed. I get dressed. Two. I get undressed. I get undressed. Three. I put on my coat. I 
Which one's my cup? Four. I take off my shoe. I take off my shoe. Five. I invite my friends to a party. I invite my friends to a party. Six. I sometimes lose things. I sometimes lose things. Aldana sometimes loses things. Okay? Listen and number. Última página, 125. Come on, fuerza, come on. We are about to finish. Language Booster 3. Recording 2. Listen. Number the pictures in order. Ponemos en orden las pictures. One. Oh no! Where's my necklace? I had it yesterday at Julia's house. Oh dear. Did you lose it? I lost my necklace. Yes, ¿qué perdió? You got that. ¿Cuál es la picture number one? La D. Yes. Yes, D. Yes or no? Yes. yes. Two. What did you do when you got to Julia's house? When I got to Julia's house, we played computer games. When I got to Julia's house, we? Played computer games. So picture two is F. Yes? Yes? Okay? Two. ¿Le pusiste el numerito? Yes. All right. Three. When we finished playing computer games, we went to the swimming pool. So when they finished playing computer games, where did they go? They went to the... Fishing pool. Fishing pool? <laughs> swimming pool, yes? C. Yes? C. Four. Then we got undressed and put on our swimming costumes. Then they got undressed and they put on their swimming costume. What letter? E. 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 I. Yes, or A. A. Look. A. I. Yes. E. Atención en el abecedario. A-I-E. Ojo. Pay attention. When I got undressed, I took off my necklace. When I got undressed, I took off my necklace. Number five. ¿Qué, qué letra? E. Yes, E. Se sacó el collar de necklace. Five. And where did you put it? Um, I know. When I took off the necklace, I put it in my bag. Where did he put the necklace? In the bag. In the bag. Six. Entonces tenemos el five, es la letra E. Yes. Is it in your bag now? Yes. Look, it's here. I didn't lose it. Okay, she didn't Wait. lose it. Yes. Okay, so the last picture is 6B, ¿ok? Ahora elegimos puntos, dale. Ah, pero primero vamos a subrayar el punto 7. El pasado de luz es lost. El pasado de put es put. El pasado de take es took. Este ya lo sabemos de la I. Y es lost boy. Y el cuadrito de lo que hicimos ejemplo hoy. When I got home, I did my homework. When I finished my homework, I went to the park. Nosotros usamos con futuro. Yes, okay. When I arrive home, cuando llegue a casa, I'm going to. Y podemos usar con pasado. Yesterday, when I arrived home, I slept. Yes, is it clear? Yes, entonces, cuando llegue a casa, dormí. Cuando llegue a casa, voy a. ¿Está? Entonces, estas cositas estuvimos practicando hoy. The last activity, number six. Number six. Are you ready? Good. When I got to Julia's house, A or B? We played computer games or we got dressed? We played computer games. Circle. Number two. When we finished playing computer games, we invited her friend to play or we went to a swimming pool? We went to a swimming pool. Yes. Number three. When I got undressed, I lost my ring or I took off my necklace? I took off my necklace. 
four, when I took off my necklace, uh, I put it in my bag or I put on my shoes? I put it in my bag. Okay, bye bye book. Yes, so attention, yes, the homework. Yes, 114, 114. Yes, okay, look at Manuel's list, wish list. Esta es una lista de deseos. And complete the test. Use the correct form of going to. Está 114, 115. Yes. 115. All right. 116. 117. 118. Y 119. ¿Ok? No te olvides de conjugar bien I'm going to más el verbo de arriba. Second, I'm going to camping. I'm going to go camping. Elijo bien. Fourth, está muy miedoso. I'm going to build a sand castle. Yes. Y con el ejemplo que tenemos ahí arriba, my summer wish list, la lista de deseos de ver, vamos a poner todas las acciones que vamos a hacer en las holidays. Pero no quédate en casa, ¿eh? Las que vamos a imaginar cosas buenas. First, I'm going to go to the beach. Second, I'm going to build a, a sand castle. Third, I'm going to relax in the beach. Fourth, I'm going to go to a water park. Fifth, I'm going to visit my grandmother. And six, I'm going to have fun. For, for example. Then, put in order. Siempre sujeto, verbo, complemento. Sujeto, verbo, predicado. Hacemos el crossword. Visit a water park. Go. Y ahí acordate, todas las que van con go. Go hiking, go camping, go sightseeing. Y es dependiendo de las palabritas de ahí. Climb a mountain, take a bus tour, tour. Y encontramos el hidden message. Complete the questions and answers. Are you going to take photos? Yes, I am. Is your brother going to blah, blah, blah? No, he isn't. Are you going to... Is it clear? Ok, ¿te acordás con is he? Otra vez la lista de palabras de vocabulario de toda la unidad. Y después completar cómo se forma el futuro. I'm not going to. Yes, we, you are going to. Yes, go surfing. Yes. Am I? Is he, she, it going to? Yes, I am. No, I am not. Am I going to visit a water park? Y después la 117, la parte de lectura. Look at the pictures and read the story. One, two, or three. Yes, and write one, two, or three words to complete sentences. Dos o tres palabras nomás para completar la frase. Está... Yes, Bob and his family were at the campsite near the beach. No puedes completar más de dos o tres palabritas. En este caso, the beach son dos palabras. Leo el texto, los textitos, ¿ok? Ah, uh, wait. Ya nos vamos. Estudia para la clase pasada, la clase que viene, porque tenemos revision. Y después, complete... Read and circle con todo el vocabulario que dimos esta clase. Complete the sentences for you. In the morning, I get dressed at, I get up at 7 o'clock. I put on my shoes. Y acá tenemos práctica específica de present simple. Yes. In the even, evening, I get dressed at, I take off my jacket. I don't want to lose my, que no querés perder, my money. My phone, my cell phone, I want to invite you to my birthday. Yes, look at the picture, match. Complete the sentences about. Y acá ha pasado, ¿eh? Cuando llegué a casa, 
Yes, when we arrive at the park, we... Yes, sobre la historia en el ejercicio 4. We played football, for example. Yes, complete the sentences for you. When I got up this morning, I washed my teeth. I cleaned my teeth. I brushed my teeth. When I went to school, I studied. When I go home uh, from school, I took off my shoes. Y dibujo las actividades. Okay? Yes? Well, so uh, that is all. Yes, son las últimas actividades porque ya después vienen actividades que vamos a usar, pero son communication activities. O sea que ponete contento porque de este activity book, la 119, es la última página que tiene eh, actividades con respecto a esto. Pay attention. Última unidad. Ponete contento, ya no hay más tema nuevo, ¿sí? Sino que a partir de ahora, ¿sí? Como todos los años, ya empezamos a trabajar con lo que queda del libro y ya después comenzarás, comenzarán las esquematizaciones con vista al examen final, ¿ok? Bye, bye. See you next class. Bye, bye. Study.